All right, guys. So this month, I've gotten three battle boxes. After a long battle with the post office, I finally got the other two. We got Mission 12, an old battle box, but I'm going to review it because I've been waiting for that one. And then, of course, I got this month's actual mission, Mission 14. Let's get into this. And whichever one I'm going to open first, because I don't know, is going to be what this movie is labeled as. So we'll go with the top. So as you can see, I am actually cutting into it. So I don't know which one's which. And we'll review the gear from there. Alright, let's see what we got. Ooh, this is actually Mission 14. Blackout. EMP attack is the sit rep. Wow, the EMP or these this box's value is $383 for the Pro Plus. Very cool. So of course, like I said, you know, the, here's the packing material, Tina Turner looking hair. It gets everywhere. Ah! Bastards. Geniuses. Just gets everywhere. Anyway, the first thing on the basic box is a Lumade pack light. It's pretty much a balloon with a solar panel on it, and it's really cool. You just open it up like so. I'm not, I'm not trying to break it, so. But, yeah, that's how you blow it up and everything, so. Oop, there it goes. Boom. Blows up quite nice. I would say this could be used as a pillow, but I don't recommend it. You might wake up with a flashlight beaming right in your eye. Then, you just on. Low, lower, and strobe. So these things were actually meant for disasters. Uh, you know, they made them for, you know, the Japanese hurricane or the, or should I say, the hurricane that happened in Japan. Um, so and it deflates pretty easily, and you can fold it right back into the, you know, the spot it was. So really nice. So. You just got to make sure. And I mean, that deflated pretty quick. Wow. So, close this up. Back down. Well, oh, something great for the pack. You know, this could be a home thing or whatever. The value of this comes in at $24.95. Not bad. Still in the basic box. You get a 115 hour candle. I mean,. I wouldn't. I would consider consider this a tiki torch. I don't know if you can actually refill this, but this would be really cool if you could. You just pop these two plastic caps off, and wow, that got me wet. That's not good. Scentless, odorless, smokeless candle. Not bad, and it's a battle box logo, so not bad. 115 hours, emergency candle. Comes in at eight dollars and forty nine cents. Now. Here's something that uh, I always enjoy is a good book, you know, especially on something like this. We got a book here, Living Off the Grid, by Dave Black. Um, simple way to, a simple guide to creating and maintaining a self-reliant supply of energy, water, shelter, and more. I haven't read this book, but I'm going to. I guarantee it's probably going to be a good read, and it's going to educate me on some uh, living off the grid. Something I want to do in the future. So the book comes in at $12.71. Very nice. Next, still on the uh, basic box. The basic box is valued up pretty high this month, which is impressive. Um, a nylon Faraday bag. Um, supposedly these things are EMP proof, um, all this good stuff. So it's not very big, but this is something like you could have your cell phone in or something else that might be in this in this box to prevent from an EMP. Um, so, yeah, not sure exactly how to fold this damn thing. So, full top of Faraday bag over twice. Oh. So, really, that's the size of your bag. Something small, so, really cool. Uh, this comes in, the Faraday bag comes in at $57.99. That better work. <laughs> and, uh, so, moving on. Now these are the same thing, just different sizes, and um, the small one costs five nineteen five dollars and nineteen cents. Medium seven eighty, and the large comes in at nine ninety nine. 
each. So, and you get two of them. Uh, they're Mylar EMP bags, and this is the large. You get two of them. So, what I would recommend, um, supposedly, you wrap them. You take your small ones, you take your items, wrap them in the small to medium ones. You put them in a Faraday bag, and then you take the large ones. Also, if you want to risk it, you know, put them in, put some other small, bigger objects in the in the big ones. So here's your small ones. Here's your large ones. That's one of them. So pretty good deal. A couple Mylar bags to go with the Faraday bag. So EMP bags, really cool. That's it for the basic box. The value of that is a hundred and fifty dollars and ten cents. Just the basic box is enough equipment to cover your entire month subscription this month. So that's really cool. Moving on to the advanced box. This little guy. Um, never thought to ever go buy one. So, I mean, it's really cool that they give you stuff like this. It's a uh, hybrid solar flashlight. Uh, one click. So it actually is battery powered and solar powered. Um, so pretty good. I don't know. I'm trying to find the lumens on here probably up front because I'm not paying any attention. <laughs> so it'll last eight hours. Uh, it's 40 lumens. That's not bad. And it's waterproof too to three meters. So in case you drop it, you know, you can still save it. It's not bad. And it lasts eight hours apparently. So that's really cool. This comes in at a value of $15. So remember, you get everything in the basic box along with the advanced box. So this comes in at $15 again. Next, now this I've been waiting for because there's a lot of talk on the forums that we might be getting one and we're getting one. The issue is now I have to go get an FCC goddamn license. <laughs> a Baofeng, ah oh, they gave me blue, Ugh. I was hoping for black, but whatever. It's a Baofeng, yeah it's Baofeng apparently, I, I was going to say Baofeng, sounds cooler. Um, Baofeng uh, ham radio with antenna charging cords so really quick uh, they're not very powerful they're not I'm not gonna talk to Russia or China or anything with this small thing I don't have capabilities but it does come with the clip so that and like I said charging cable and a lanyard I guess and the charging port. Um, you cannot transmit on these things, period, without an FCC license. Um, you can monitor these, you can program up to 150 uh, channels, so police, EMTs, any emergency, um, weather, all that stuff. This can actually do some pretty good stuff, so keep that in mind. These are actually really cool, and I recommend them. Um, this is something I'm going to be throwing in the EMP bag and just forgetting it. I mean, or I go when I or when I go out on a hike and I might fall off a mountain or something and bust my leg. I'm going to need an emergency. Help me! Help me! Hopefully that doesn't happen because that would suck ass. And I dropped a piece. Oh no! It went into the no man's land. Oh shit! I'm off camera. Oh, found it. All right, that's pretty cool. Nice little ham radio. I never would have bought one. Put all that stuff in there. And yes, read the instructions on that for the love of God because you will mess that thing up. Play with it though. Uh, that comes in at a value of $32.99. Bringing the total value of the advanced bo box to $198.08. That is really good. Now, going up to the pro level, we got a. Oh, another radio. A NOAA radio. So, this is really cool, um, 11 bands, AM, FM, shortwave, uh, LED flashlight, nice, um, reading lamp, self-powered hand crank, uh, adjustable solar panel, nice, uh, built-in rubberized carry strap, includes micro USB to charge most, oh, so it's, you can charge your cell phone off this thing while it's solar panel, or you can crank it, there you go. Um, you got extra large tuning dials, I guess, because if they're small, uh, I guess you over. I don't, I don't know. That's pretty cool. Let's let's take this. Let's take this out of the box real quick. Ah, oh, mine is exactly the same color. Darn it's red. Now, that's something I wouldn't put in a pack, but you know, something to have when I go camping or something. But yeah, so you got the solar panel right here, the light, the reading light right here, battery pack. 
Oh, there's the flashlight. I don't know how to turn it on. I'm not going to. Oh. Nope, it apparently hasn't gotten enough charge, so. You know, I'm used to doing this, but only with my coffee grinder. But the end result's not going to be as good. Oh. Now? I don't think that'd be a really good sustaining way to charge it because I'm not getting anywhere with this thing. Just... Yeah, see, I didn't want to cooperate. Lights are off. We got battery, solar crank. There it is. There. It does work. This doesn't stay on. Like I said, it's not a really good sustaining way. Now, we have a lantern and a USB charger for it. So, bam. Solar powered, of course. Boom. Wow, that's bright. That's pretty cool. Definitely throwing that in my kit for my single man tank. So, and it makes a flashlight too. That's pretty cool. And you can charge other stuff off of it. You can charge it or charge other items. So, definitely a lot of self sustaining. And you can hang this, it does come with a little hook. So, but yeah, you can do a lot with this. This thing's pretty cool. I like versatility on items, so that's pretty good. Uh, this comes in at a value of $40. Not bad. That's very cool. So that told, brings the total of the Pro Box this month to $288.02. Um, let's see, what else did we get in here? We got some $10 off uh, your next order from Lumage, so that's pretty cool. Use the, uh, use the uh, code. I'm not going to show you because it's mine. You got a Lumage. Uh, coupon for ten dollars off your next purchase, um, and of course we got one from Hybrid Light too, uh, twenty percent off uh, on any order with a confirmation code there, right here. So really cool. Might be checking them out for more items. He has some really good stuff. And, uh, let's see, what is this? Yeah, this something just fell out. Yeah, the lantern. So all right, moving on. Knife of the Month Club Pro Plus. It's a clecker. I've never owned a clecker. You know, everybody says they're great. This is pretty. You know, night heavy knife actually for the size of it. Um, so let's take a look at it. Wow, this thing is uh, this thing's gorgeous. I mean, this is like a knife I wouldn't even want to use. Ooh, that's sharp. Yeah, but that's I mean that is very lightweight in the blade. Ooh, good locking. I you know. Oh, no, that's what that is. So okay, so that's where the tension's at. Uh, very cool. Multicolor, you know. That's pretty cool. Got a little deep pocket clip, so you know this thing will be hidden really nice. Um, very small, very cool drop point on there. Um, nice belly, nice. Very good blade. I mean, I'm you know good quality steel is what everybody's saying about collectors. Um, this is the light one. There's actually a bigger one. I might be getting. This one might be getting deboed from me. Not gonna happen. I like this knife. So this comes in at a value of $95 even. I didn't round up, it actually is $95. So, bringing the total monthly box to $383, like I said in the beginning. That is really cool. You get a nice little knife. And you do get various knives throughout the, each battle box, so very cool. So, like I said, go check them out. A link will be in the description. Um, also check out my other reviews. I'm kind of a clown this time, I'm just trying to burn through it because, you know, I don't like to sit there and edit two videos together and cut out some information. 
like it did on my last one. But yeah, go check out BattleBox, veteran owned, veteran started. So trying to get their name out there. Um, so tell your friends, your family, you know, they might like this box. So, all right, I got one more review to go to. So we'll definitely be seeing you here in about five minutes when I do this one. So, all right.